Shalom, children of Israel. My name is Mikkel Massa. Greetings to all the scattered children of Israel in the four corners of the earth. Um, today's topic is about Islam. We want to know um, who are the Islam in the Bantu perspective. Because we always hear the perspective of um, Europeans about the Islam, uh, the perspective of Hebrew Israelites. But today we want to know what the Bantu said about uh, the Islam. Easy. You should know something about um, uh, Ishmael. Ishmael is born um, from Abraham and from Agar. Agar um, is Egyptian, and the Asian Egyptians were black. The Asian people from the Asian Mohammedans, or let's call them Ishmaelites, these people were black. And you should know this people was doing um, business with, with Europeans. They was doing business with so-called Arabs. They was doing um, business from Somalia down to Mozambique, Kenya, etc. And uh, to make it clear, we will talk here about who these people are. We will talk about their spirituality and we will talk about um, a little bit about Allah. So um, it starts that the Bantu people, yeah, um, the Bantu people has always problems, yeah, with uh, Ishmael. Bantus came from Jacob or Yaakubu. And uh, let, let us read the preparation that I have for you tonight um, so you will understand. Now, we will start. We will start with this one here. Look at this picture. Around 900. Israel in Congo language is solely I choose you sometimes identifies as Israel Yisai. in Congo language Tontu Yabeto today Bantu already bears the germs of fully constituted states with fortified administrative centers and places in stone of size in Megiddo building identically reproduced by the Hebrew Bantu exiled from Great Bantu Zimbabwe before the Edomites European discovered Africa. They were surprised to find the Bantu architecture on the right. Great Zimbabwe looked strangely like the current Jerusalem architecture occupied by Edom and the nations. Ezekiel 26, 5 to 10. Here. Now, Suba, ancient village in Israel, current Jerusalem, village of the Tekoites, taking in current Jerusalem, in the Middle East, in ruins, village that still bears the name Bantu, Suba. Suba means P in Bantu language, as illustrated in the current Jerusalem tourist book. Left photo. Now, Suba village of Jerusalem, beloved, this proves that it is the Bantu who lived in the present Middle Eastern Israel. For they left and kept the same architecture and the Bantu names. So, now, around 900 Israel or Yisrael and Samaria, Jerusalem, in contrast, is really urbanized only a little before 700. And the industrializations of production beginning only after that date. Israel and Galas and Judah for Bakongos have in common the cult of Nzambi, translated as Yah the Father, Jeremiah 31 9 and Matthew 23 9. But they also practice the cult of other gods of their widely 
Penicians neighbors, Nilotic Canaanites who are today. Now listen carefully. These are the Hamites, okay? The Somalians, a sea people, fierce pirates, other Canaanites such as the Afars, Luos, Maasai, Tutsis, Ormos, Palashas. Their gods and goddesses such as Baal, Bala, or Balis, or Astade, or Asi, Moloch, Ya, as a Moloch god of the Ammonites today known as the Berber Tuares. Moreover, the Berber Ammonites of Morocco have kept the name of the ancient capital Rabah. Deuteronomy 3.11. Let us prove it. You will you have to understand something. The maps that you see today that who Canaanites are in the Middle East, so uh, Assyria was in, in, in Asia, and then you will see Babylon was somewhere in like Europe and Asia, and etc. All these maps are not so real. But we will prove it because we are Bantu and we have to show it step by step. And uh, this is the thing. Um, we know who we are, but even our people are ignorant people and they don't want to be um, to learn. But if you see the other nations, like uh, American black people or black people discovered in, in, in Brazil and somewhere else in, in, in Australia, they want to know their heritage. They are hungry. They want to know the truth. But our people in the Congo or in Angola or something, they are they are like uh, they are for the white Jesus. They are following these things. But we are coming to that later. But why why is this like this? So now first we are going now to Deuteronomy three and eleven. So it's very important, yeah. It's very important to know that. Um, oh, this is German. I'm here in Germany. You should know that. Now, for only Og, king of Bashan, remained of the remnant of giants. Behold, his bedstead was a bedstead of iron. Is it not in Rabbah? You see that? Of the children of Ammon. Do you see that? Nine cubits was the length thereof, and four cubits the breadth of it after the cubit of a man now if you see Rabat, yeah you see these people are the morocco if i go now to Rabat today look at this I can i can I can show you here Rabat city and uh you are here you see it's in morocco Can you see that? They directly show you Bilal ibn Rabah. They have even the name. Yeah. Here is the city. And that's why I want to teach you one by one African history. I have prepared even something for you for the next lesson. So I want. Um, our brothers, our Jewish brothers, yeah, uh, to show them you know, the Bantu history and the histories from the our neighbors, the the, the Canaanites, the Hamites. So, in the time the 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 the, 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 the Jews from America, from 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 Brazil, and everywhere discovered, they will come back. They will know the differences. Who is who? Yeah, they, because this is very important. Because uh, you have to know more about. Africa, yeah, you have to know more about Africa. It's very important, and uh, we will begin with Islam today, because Islam is not that what you people think it might be. Islam is very dangerous. Everybody knows that we are fighting against spirits. So if you see something like a Kaaba or a stone, a black stone, they say it comes from another universe. So <laughs> who do they worship really, or what is inside this Kaaba? Or what means it? Now, the Kaaba black and holy stone in Islam. She is worshipped according to the same principles. We call that uh, first black inhabitants of Arabic called Zibina. 
practice vitalism, animism. It is one of phases of African spirituality that has deeply changed the white Semites, came later to found Islam. The Kaaba was then worshipped by Sabians as Africans. They went on pilgrimage and sang and danced. They also practiced the cult of sun, the messengers of the male and female God, and cult later demonized by the Quran, Surah 27, we can still find these relics in Islam. The five daily prayers are simply the seven daily prayers of the Zabians, which are performed according to the different positions of the sun during day. Now, um, as we could read, yeah, uh, it was black people that founded this Islam. There was even with Mansa Musa um, and other leaders in the West Africa coast. That's why we always talking about uh, the migration of Moses or Maza. They came out of Egypt and Egypt was already uh, uh, um, Hamite area. And they should go to another land, a new land. And this new land cannot be the Middle East because uh, the Middle East also is Egypt. Now, they has to go to a new land. And this was the, the, the Central Africa today because they has to pass the Somalians, they has to pass uh, this, this, this Ishmaelites in the Western coast of Africa, the people from Benin, they have to pass all these Hamites, a lot of Hamites because a lot of uh, Hebrew Israelites outside there thinking they're Benin people or because in the West African card, you can see Judah right there, that Judah is there. Judah is everywhere in Africa. There is Judah, but you will understand it later. That's why we have to we have to bring off more African history. It's very important to bring African history inside uh, this this uh, channel, yeah, because we want uh, you to become spiritual. Now, this is the point. What means spiritual? After Abraham, uh, 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 the, the Nilotic, he went out of this cult. He, uh, the Most High, uh, 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 shows he shows that he is his son, uh, that he should uh, bear uh, the sons, yeah, that will uh, uh, follows, and the Most High will uh, be in his sons. So we have the Ishmaelites, and uh, the Ishmaelites. The most I told them that these people will be blessed with 12 kingdoms, they will have their money, they will have their area, and they will be very bloody people, very aggressive people against their brothers. So who are their, their brothers? It's the Bantu people. So the Hamites and the Ishmaelites, they had one land mass. One land mass. So um, this is the truth. Yeah, this is the real truth. So if Afro Americans, our brothers, say that everyone in Africa is a Hamite, where they want to go? The Middle East. <laughs> the Middle East is not their home. Their, their home is Africa, and this will never change. If the Bible says you should go where you come from, it's not the Middle East, y'all. Now. These people, this this Arabic people, this black people they uh, uh, mingle themselves together with other blacks. This means white and blacks, Ismailites, uh, was against the Bantu people. Yeah, They was against the Bantu people. They, they, they enslaved white people and they enslaved black people. Okay? So Hamites sold, uh, uh, Hamites sold Hebrew Israelites, Bantu. It's the Bantu. It's history. This is history. This is you cannot deny it. You cannot say I am from from I am an Israelite if you're not the Bantu because it's the Bantu went to slavery. It's not the Israelites. It's the Bantu went to slavery. Okay. If we say the Israelite went to Israel, uh, uh, slavery, it's like you saying the Caucasians went to slavery because it's not in the history. Yeah. You cannot say you cannot show me where the Caucasian black, uh, white people went into the slavery. This so-called Khazars or uh, uh, Turkish people or Russian, whatever. But you can say the Bantu went to slavery and not once, but they went often to slavery. 
So you are a Bantu. That's why we will want to learn here who you are and who is your enemy. In Psalms 83, you can see very clear that you can see the Somali era, you can see the, um, the Oromo, even the Falashas, you can see them, the Beninois, many people from Nigeria, you can see them, uh, even people from Ghana. That's why you have their um, Islam. Yeah. It's normal. You see them? Everywhere. Can you see that? This is Nigeria. This is your Nigeria where you want to go. You want to go to an Islamic state, yo. This is your Nigeria. That is the truth about Nigeria. It's Islamic. Okay? <laughs> so, uh, you people have to know, if you want to uh, to to follow Yah, follow him with the spirit, but don't follow him with your heart. That's why you have to see this page here. You have to know this, this, this. You have to know Mika Masa, because Mika Masa will show you that step by step. Yeah. So if you want to, if the day the most High will open you the doors to coming back home, you will know where Israel is. You will know who, who your enemies is. You will know who is who. Because most people, we come from West Africa, West Africa this, West Africa this, West Africa. You're not coming from West Africa, yo. You fled from West Africa. Yeah. Because West Africa was dominated by Islam. Okay, now um, you have to know something. If you if, if you see the Islam, how could these people win over the Bana Babantu? These people knows us from 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 beginning. Yeah, and this means we had one landmass. We was always fighting with them. Some of them was raping our women, but we also kicked them ass. Okay, because we had this one here. Like you see, uh, you you already has read the kingdom of 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 of, of um, the kingdom that we have in the Mozambique and uh, in Zimbabwe. Uh, you see in Kenya. You see we we had in, in Botswana and stuff. This will be my next lesson. So keep on uh, looking my videos. Yeah. Now we had kingdoms. This were kingdoms. We had twelve kingdoms. So they could not win over us. They could not do anything. But they was doing um, business with white people. Yeah, they was doing business with Bantu people. So uh, they was like our brothers. We had these kings, kingdoms. We had big kingdoms. So uh, this, this is not a joke. Yeah, This is our kingdom right here. You see that? Boats. This is Africa, yo. This is Africa, houses, but no one will tell you that because they have, uh, they have, um, they give us a colonized uh, view of Africa. They, they do not tell you that Israel is in Africa because they say Israel is in the Middle East, but they do not tell you that really Israel is in Africa, in Central Africa. So, uh, they, do not, they do not tell you that Africa is the biggest continent on earth. They do not tell you that Africa is not only Africa, but you have, you have different tribes, different people inside Africa. Now, watch this. Um, we have to talk about the spirituality. We have to talk about the spirituality in Islam. Now, you should know something. First thing you should know is this. If we talk about jinn, you see, this is the true face of a jinn. A jinn, also in Aladdin as genie, is not a genius. They show him as a genius because he is the devil. You see, Islam is spiritual. If we talk about Islam, we're talking about uh, we're talking about people. Yeah, they know a lot of things about the Bantu, but because the Most High 
had no mercy on Ishmael. He says, Ishmael will be and he is the enemy of the children of the Bantu forever. Yeah. So the Islam becomes also like a fallen angel, like demonic. They are the enemy of the Bantu. So if we go to uh, the spirituality of these people, you will see these people have everywhere, they have stores, they taking our goods, they're selling it everywhere. They uh, doing movies there everywhere because they uh, have uh, Pakistan under control, so a little of India, we have this Turkey and Islam is big. Islam is big and everywhere. They have football teams. It's like the Mexican people, if they come new to America, they're taking good places, good works. Uh, they become good works. And the American blacks, people that uh, builded America, they stay, they, they are staying back. They, they, they have to fight, they are struggling. The most of the black people think this, this has to do with their color. Not really. We have to know that this world here belongs to Satan. And if you are spiritual, so this means if you <laughs> belongs also to Satan, he will give you work, he will protect you, he can give you everything. Now, why the most of the Islamic people here in Germany is great. You can see that very easy. These people are selling, the name is... These people have all the market in Germany. Even you can see, the, even German, because Germany is going to the end. Yeah, uh, we have here many shops, they are closing because the world is changing. Yeah, the world is changing and the world is going now to end because they cannot steal like they were stealing before. They had no minerals. They have no minerals. They have only, uh, here in Europe, they have only paper. They have only their cars that they can sell. They have only their goods that they can sell. But they have no natural resources. So they have a big problem. Now, this is their Turkish food. Yeah, They're selling it everywhere and everyone is eating it. It's not even healthy. Yeah, It's not even healthy. But um, you can see they're selling it everywhere. So um, they have... Uh, no, this these people they love each other. They love each other, each other, and they have one enemy. The enemy they say is 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 is, is the um, are the Jews. The enemy are the Jews. Now you have to understand this. What do you think? This will be in the next part of Islam because I will not put it inside here. I will talk and show you um, more about the verses that um, the Islam is using that shows that even Maza and Christ are black. It's written in the Quran, like you can see here. This will be next part. Now, this Islam that we are talking about is very spiritual. This means everything that you want, you will get it from Allah. Now, as you can see, Allah is the dragon. Allah is he who will get in heaven power. He will overcome later to fighting the world. He will fight Europe. And people will not believe it now, but we can prove it. We can prove it because Europeans are very, uh, they're all, all, all over the world, the people are against black. They see only color. Even our black people, they see only color. Why this and this? But they don't see the spirituality behind it. They don't see that everything is spiritual. And uh, they have first to learn, yeah, who is who, 
then they have to learn yeah that even his friend can be an enemy so you don't have friends if you don't know the, the spiritual world now this verse here shows us very clear this is second uh, Esther 15 and 29 um This is Second King. Can I have it, please? Now, Second Esdras and fifteen. Now, verse twenty nine says. The nations of the serpents of Araba will go out with many chariots from the day they began their journey. Their hissing will echo over the earth so that all who hear them fear them and tremble. So, like I told you, um, Allah will come and will destroy and he will come with new um, lessons like Sharia, etc., etc. The genie, yeah, is giving them everything. That's where you see them. They have rings. You see, why do they wear black clothes? Rings and uh, they have special oils. They are smelling differently. Many things they have it from uh, the Hebrew cult. Yeah. So the Bantu tradition say it like this: many things, even how they are, the things they're wearing. Our women do not wear all of those things here, no. But our thing, our our women's they have our traditional clothes. Look, you see. So many, many, many nations try to copy it, yeah, because they came from us, or we were slaves. Let's say we we are the first humans. So you can see this kind of traditional clothes everywhere on earth, but it's not the same. Solomon was not wearing this type of garments like the Hebrew Israelites are wearing. Yeah. Look at this. This is not this is not the type of cloth, yeah. The uh, the Asian people was wearing, yeah. No, but this year, this is this is near to us, yeah. This is near to us. We are wearing this kind of kind kind of clothes. You see that traditional cloth, yeah. And Solomon was wearing things like that. So, no, I could not find him. You you would see the the kings how there was uh, there was uh, what kind of clothes they were wearing. It's very important. You will see, yeah, and they're wearing this clothes that I uh, I showed you before. Now, if we're talking about the Islam, people, my brothers and sisters, you should know that Islam is not uh is very dangerous. They are more dangerous than the Christians. Because the Islam, they are the people that will fight in the use of fat, like with against the Christians and against the so-called Jews. That's why we have nothing to do with this fight. We will not go, we will not be in the Middle East in this time. You can believe me. Christ Himself says we will not worship no more here in this area here. We will worship the real worshippers, they will worship that will be another area that we will go. And uh, you have to know, I could not say everything about the Islam, like uh, 
more the other things you have to know is like a lot of their spirituality because they are selling the chinese are selling their spirituality we have the the the, the, the muslims they're selling their spirituality the europeans selling their spirituality we have the japanese they're selling their spirituality here this is japanese uh, spirituality we have uh chakra uh we have um uh what they do they, they, they have a lot of things they do yeah um the the, the 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 chinese they doing many things like messages yeah they have messages special messages they have special oils they have um They have medicines, you know, but what is with our spirituality? What is with with, 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 with our herbs? What is with, what is what is with our things? Our African American or African Bantu things? No one knows. That's why you could see in the movie Black Panther. Yeah. uh in the movie black panther yeah you could you could see uh that they was talking uh, they was talking about medicine you see and uh the white guy was healed by this medicine and stuff because we have all kind of medicines ningunzas have it so this is the things that we want to learn even our ancestors there was the there, there was the first healers we came out with math we came out with astrophysics astrology we came out with uh we with, with, with making cars boats uh uh helicopters and stuff it could it, this this is kind of technologies of a uh, ufo it came from us bantu like daniel was a slave in the babylonian captivity he shows this 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 magician that he is better that he know more because of the spirit and this is the spirit that we want we want to learn about the ruach how the ruach wor works and if you want to know you have to go back to the roots now um these people this 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 uh, uh, muslims they are very intelligent and very smart because they belongs to allah and allah is satan allah is giving them everything they we have they have hadiths they have verses in their quran if you want a woman they can get a woman if they want money that's why they go also fridays to pray they get the money you see if they want their shops to going well and this is it the most bantu people you have to know we have bantu people that know about he knows about um, selling things like in the Cameroon we have uh, these tribes how call them um, Cameroon um, Cameroon tribes voila then you have wait 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 we have in the Cameroon, like also in the in the in the in the, in the Congo, we have the the, the Bakongo. These people are um, these people know about uh, selling goods. These are these people are they know selling things, and um, then you have in the Congo also uh, many many tribes. They know about selling things. Yeah. Uh, it's not everyone. If you see in 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 in, in America or stuff, or everywhere they scatter the black the black people. It's not every black people have the gifts to sell in goods, but there are some of us. They are they are uh, especially the, these Levites. They know how to selling things. Yeah, they selling. They, they they. It's like Abraham. Then he knows how to sell. Isaac. All of them were uh, business people. They could know. They they, they could do business. You know um yeah then you have to know something um 
then you have to know something. Um, we have this Arabic people, they baptize their children if they are young, uh, they are baptizing their children. And they are saying Quran verses into their ears. So these people are already protected. Yeah. Uh, 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 uh. They, these people, you have to know the southern part of uh, Cameroon. These people, the most of them are, are Bantu. And the northern part of Cameroon, these people, the most of them are Fulani. Uh, so these people in the southern part. These people are the uh, children of Israel, okay? And, uh, um, yeah, so you have um, this baptism. So Islam is not physical, but Islam is spiritual. It's not that what you see uh, as a man, that he is from Islam, but that what is inside him, that is the Islam. That is the thing that means if war comes, they will go to war because that what is inside them says to them, we have to go to war. They cannot do nothing against it. And this is the jinn. This means they becoming jinns. These jinns giving them power, knowledge, etc., etc. That's why the Islam, the white Edomites, they taken uh, uh, the, the the Islamic people from 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 everywhere, Pakistan and everywhere, to helping them with astronomy, physics, and astrology, maths, and a lot of things. They have even Muhammad, the uh, statue of Muhammad, is everywhere. The statue of Muhammad, you see, it's everywhere, the statue of Muhammad. So, um, this statue of Muhammad, Muhammad is here in the middle. He's like a monument. He's like a, a big star everywhere on earth. He's a, he's a part of the spiritual world of the Caucasian man. Yeah. Um, and they know it. They know it. So Islam has nothing to do with the black man. Yeah. Only if you need fast money, fast women, and fast this and this and this. So you have to be very careful about Islam.